All right, what is up? Um, this is the uh, shot of the uh, one one thousand scale refit Enterprise. Here's a shot of the three fifty scale Enterprise. Hmm. But uh, all in all, this one I have to say is a very nice kit. Uh, really, when you look up at it close, I mean, there's you know you really don't lose a lot of detail. And the uh, decal sheets really make a difference in the the detailing, but the sculpt is really really nice. I mean, there's a lot of detail in this little thing, and uh, you can see the photon little area right there. Um, everything is painted on this. Uh, there is no uh, well, not everything is painted, of course, but a nice base coat of uh, bright silver. Uh, uh, then on top of that I spray a, a Tamiya pearl white on top of that and um, I try to leave a little bit of the silver showing through to a degree and that's what kind of gives it the little silver undertone yeah well Sherlock Holmes could tell you that but uh, that's just the two the, the layering that the, the pearl kind of just allows but I think it comes out really nice for this kit. Uh, over here, uh, let me just pull out and uh, show you the workspace that I've got set up for myself. It's. I w wish I could say that it looks better than this on good days, but I'm just going to say that this is the sign of a table that gets worked on a lot and has a lot of work on it. Uh, you can see uh, almost nearly to the ceiling <laughs> are some models that I'm going to be working on. Um, all of them at some point will be uh, getting my attention. Um, this up here is actually the uh, the three and a quarter. Well, well, this is the action figure sized A wing. So uh, I'm going to eventually do some work on this. I'm probably going to put some lights in it because it looks like there's a little. There's a, a gap here for some batteries, and uh, like I can rig a, a light back there, but um, really that's it. It's uh, again, it's the toy, but it seemed to be. I know the cockpit is probably a little too large, but you know, I'm, I've never been that much of a stickler for details, so that's going to be getting some model paint treatment, so uh, that's going to be off in the distant future, but. But right now I'm going to be coming back to this one, which is going to actually complete the rest of that model right there. That's been sitting around for about two months in this state, all rigged up with lights, ready to go. I just have to do the engineering section again, and uh, hopefully not throw it against the wall and bite it. But uh, it, this doing this kit really got me off my ass on this one. It's, uh, it's an equally nice kit, just microwaved. Here's a shot of the uh, same scaled uh, NX-01 complete with decals from A-Creation models or A-Creation decals but guy does some really great work it goes on really 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 subtle so uh, it it makes for a nice model I mean I, I it probably would have had a problem with it if it showed up a little more but I think it came out nice for being such a small scale. This one I thought was, you know, when you put it together and actually when you bu when you look at the box on the shelf, it looks like it could be a really nice big model, you know. But you open it up and you kind of have a feeling that you have a cereal box toy, especially compared with that one. This one has uh, been retired to the garage. For now, um, it's going to be sitting up on my shelf along with the other kits up here that have been destroyed throughout the years. Uh, uh, Galaxy class. Uh, there's uh, the rest of this NC. This is the uh, Enterprise B, which is floating around here somewhere. Uh, I got the C up over here. This is in pretty good condition. It was a pretty sturdy model. But uh, I think it needs a repaint job. It needs a, it's time for a repaint. It's 
time for some new decals. Uh, you can see right there, they just yellowed out on me, and I, I totally blame myself for that. That was uh, me using some different uh, products for the, uh, the finish. But uh, all right, well that's a look at my bench. This is a look at my girlfriend's bench over here. She took over my table, where I was originally set up, and she's got polymer clay going now. Finally talked her into doing something now, so she's doing something. Awesome. There are the nacelles. These are still getting the decal work done to them. Uh, I didn't do any seam work again, you know, so... Again, you know, I really should work on my building techniques, or my building skill, rather than just waiting for the paint job and having a bunch of lousy seams on a really nice kit but um, anyway I just wanted to give you all a small update get a quick shot of the uh, of the 1701 refit I also show you all a little bit of my work area I've got a lot of work cut out for me I've got polar lights well this is this is the Mobius kit this is the 350 scale uh, sea view that has lights uh, I've got the stingray I'm still working on uh, I'm really stoked cause uh, I don't know I, I found the font for this on the internet so I'm probably gonna make a nice plaque for that when I'm done uh, that's, that's really about it I've got the big giant millennium falcon over here this one's been pushed to the back of the line till I finish off the enterprise but that was started. Got a few holes drilled up in this one for some lights. Uh, I still need to do some more work on the paint job here, but uh, this is level one of the layering effect here, so uh, this is what it looks like. That's after a couple of coats of uh, some weathering uh, paint and uh, whatnot. But anyway, y'all have a good time. Hope y'all have some good models coming out pretty soon, and I'll see y'all later. Bye.